What up, y'all? What's the motherfucking deal? Okay, so I'm going to come to y'all and let y'all know about this. I kind of mentioned it in the mukbang video today, but um, y'all, let me tell y'all who sent this to me. My girl, um, Sharon Huff. Thank you so, so much for sending this article to me um, <clears throat> to keep me in the know. Y'all, listen to this. Okay. The CDC reports a major illness outbreak in 34 states tied to this food. Listen to this. <clears throat> The outbreak was first noted by the CDC on July 20th after, oh, and this is from um, Eat This, Not That website, y'all. Eatthis.com is what it's called. That's why I'm referencing um, this article. Um, the outbreak was first noted by the CDC on July 20th after salmonella from an unknown source have resulted in at least 125 people getting ill in 15 states, y'all, resulting in 24 hospitalizations, but no deaths. Now the CDC has pinned down the cause. A crop of red onions made by a California producer. Yo, Thompson, Tom's, I'm sorry, Thompson, International Incorporation. The company has since recalled all of its onions, regardless of color, in all 50 states. Woo! The Food and Drug Administration issued an advisory for consumers, restaurants, and retailers directing each to not eat, sell, or serve red, white, yellow, or sweet onions from Thompson International Incorporated or products containing such onions. Since it's nearly impossible to tell the origin of loose onions purchased at a grocery store, okay? Because that's what I was just saying in my head. Like, how are we supposed to know where the onions came from? You know? Should we just not eat onions? No onions? I literally have two bags of onions that I just bought. Like, how many days ago? Like, four days ago? Y'all. Okay, um... Since it's, nearly, since it's nearly impossible to tell the origin of loose onions purchased at a grocery store, the FDA advised consumers to throw out any onions of unknown origin. Everybody is going to have to throw away their onions because who knows where their onions came from unless you went and picked them out of your garden. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh my goodness. Y'all. Onions? <sighs> okay. Um, as you can see in the map below, okay, there's a map, y'all, um, provided by the CDC, California, Oregon, and Nevada have reported the most cases related to the Thompson produced onions. Northern, Midwestern, and Western states like Michigan and Montana have also reported an alarming number of cases. Onions are not the only food item currently Presenti presenting salmonella concerns. There is also a larger larger and multi-strain outbreak from poultry products that have led to roughly a thousand cases and even one death. Wow. The CDC updated a food safety alert last week warning consumers about a salmonella outbreak linked to poultry in backyard flocks such as chicks and ducklings. Oh my gosh. Common symptoms of salmonella include diarrhea, fever, and abdominal cramps, though more severe cases of salmonellosis may include a high fever, aches, headaches, lethargic, a rash, uh, blood in the urine, a stool, and in some cases may become fatal. Anyone who believes that they may have this infection should immediately contact their healthcare provider. Wow. Y'all, when I tell you, if it ain't one thing, it is another. If it ain't COVID, then it's another strain of flu, y'all. I really, honestly, I feel like something big is gonna happen. Even, and then that big old explosion over there, like, so much is going on all at the same time. Like, simultaneously, y'all, and like, 
I just, I don't, I just feel like, like, this is the end, y'all. This is the end. Like, I do believe that this is the end of the world. Like, it's coming to an end. Like, God is coming back, y'all. I'm trying to tell you. I don't know what y'all believe in, but that's what I believe. I believe he is coming back soon. He's coming back. Mm, mm, mm. Like he said he would. I know that. Yeah, yeah, it's gonna be alright. He's coming back. Mm, 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 mm. Um, was it for the true and good? Anyway, so, yes, that's how I feel. Like, there's just too much stuff going on, y'all. This is the end of time. It is the end, y'all. Let me know what y'all think. That's what I think. I think it's the end of time. Um, let me see. She sent something else too. Let's see what this is. Okay, same thing. It's the same thing. Oh, snap! Let me read this. I'm glad I clicked on it. Red, white, yellow, and sweet yellow onions with various brand names have been recalled nationwide due to possible salmonella contamination there have been hundreds of reported oh i thought it wasn't on anymore i'm sorry there has been hundreds of reported cases and multiple hospitalizations including some in north carolina included in this recall are the brand names okay here we go food lion y'all we used to shop at food lion oh my gosh we no longer shop at Food Lion because they don't have a food line over here. But they have a food line on the southwest side where we used to live. Yes, sir. Thompson Premium, TLC Thompson In International, Tender Loving Care, El Competitor, Hartley's Best, Onions 52, Majestic Imperial Fresh, Kroger, and uh, Utah onions. What? They didn't name H-E-B, y'all. That's why I get all of my groceries. I don't even shop at Kroger anymore. Oh, my God. Excuse the background. Anyway, uh, Kroger, though, y'all. I'm, I'm so glad I don't shop at Kroger. Because Kroger, they a little too expensive. That's why I shop at H-E-B. H-E-B has the best prices to me out of all of them. Like... Walmart too. Walmart be tripping. Okay, then prices be off the chain. Hey, I'm filming. I'm filming a video. They don't care. Anyway, so yeah, y'all. So take note. These are the places that y'all need to watch out for. Other, uh, other. Uh, I'm sorry. The brand names. <laughs> don't get no onions from Kroger. Don't get any onions from Kroger, y'all. Go where, uh, wherever else, you know, that they're selling onions because if they're selling them, then they must be fine. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, like I said, wherever else they're um, selling them, they must be fine. If they're selling them, they must be fine. Um, so, yeah. Anyway. Hope y'all enjoyed this little informative video. Hope y'all appreciate that because I appreciate when y'all send me stuff because a lot of times I'm not even going to know about it probably if y'all don't send it. You know what I'm saying? Like it just doesn't, everything doesn't run across, you know, my eyes all the time. Anyway, if y'all know of anything that's going on that I don't know anything about, please let me know in the comments or email me anything y'all or if y'all want me to um talk about something or react to something um send it to my email don't send me no bull corn you know what i'm saying that you know i'm not gonna react to all right just don't just please just don't even waste your time okay so yeah send me um you know stuff to react to and i'll react to it um videos or maybe an article or, or whatever or anything that you want me to talk about or if you need advice email me email me um and then yeah people have been asking me to do like advice um like videos like have people like um email me like certain situations or whatever and you know ask me what i would do or um, they want to know, you know, what they should do 
Anyway, just email me. I don't have all the answers, but you know, I am 45, so I've lived. Anyway, so yeah, I've lived. So, um, I know a couple of things. But anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. If you did, please thumbs up this video and subscribe and share, share, share everywhere. And I will see you guys later. <laughs> Peace.